Hello everyone, Luke Forsmith here. It is Tuesday, it is the 12th. Um, we got a review, review Tuesday. This is going to be of a Harry Potter USB powered light. It is a Bell Jar light, um, right here. There we go. Um, it's got the golden snick in it. And yeah, it's basically a USB uh, light, it, which makes it look like the um, Lesnick is floating, um, as you can see. Um, I'll, I'll get it out at the box now because you'll probably end up seeing it a bit better. Uh, it's USB, so the best thing about if you get a, a light or a device that's USB only, don't plug it into your computer. Get a um, get a like a, a old phone charger that a USB cable can plug into, and then just use one of them. So um, okay, so we got the instructions here, little instruction booklet. We got a um, the USB thing here, the U USB cable. Let's actually have a look at the um, at the ends okay yeah that's the end like a micro us not really a micro usb but it's um it's something yeah just go into any phone charger as long as it's not a usb c to usb c phone charger it'll be fine so let's take out the um this bit of cardboard here there you go and um let me just pull all of this out Alright, let me just put this over here and um, this just slides out this way like that. I believe that this is a touch sensitive one. On the back you've got the um you've got the little slot that the USB thing goes into and um, there is no on and off switch um, on it which probably means let me just unplug my um studio light there stay yeah it probably means um because there's no switch on it um the only way to um turn it on and off is to just unplug it so we are going to unravel which this ca this cable is actually a decent length I'm quite surprised on ha how good the length, length is. So we're going to plug this into my computer right there. And um, we're going to get this. Oh, before I plug it in, let's have a look Look at it. It's got a few scratch marks in it, but it's it's plastic. It, it's not glass. I, I'm, I'm going to clean it up. It's already got smokers in it. So here you go. Here's the, um, the snitch in it. As you can see, um, there's a little... Um, tube that goes into the bottom of the snitch that's where your um the light is going to come through so let's plug this in uh, what's this say micro usb input okay it is micro usb fog five foot uh, five volt uh, dc adapter so that's the um that's what it takes oh am i plugging in right yeah There you go. Oh, it doesn't channel up the light. Okay. So there it is. Let me just um turn the um the light off. <clears throat> it actually looks quite nice. It looks quite decent. As you can see it like illuminates the underneath of it so it looks like it's it's floating in in the darkness i um i just remembered now where i'm actually recording this bit after the video <laughs> you, you can turn this off you have to like use your you got yeah you got to use it there you go you got to do it hard enough for it to do how does that work That's clever. That is clever. Now I know I can do that. 
I'm probably am going to like use it on my desktop because now I can like turn it on and turn it off whenever I like. So probably, but yeah, there you go. <laughs> that was interesting. Okay, uh, back to the review. As you can see there, it, it, it is a bright, it is a bright light right there. Um, top of it. Let's have a look behind it. Oh, it's basically same thing from from both angles so yeah it, obviously it's got the Harry Potter um, logo right there it's quite good I quite like this it is nice and bright and you can like see it from like it shines underneath I thought it I thought it would shine up the little tube but that that tube is there to make it look like it's floating like if, if you're looking at it from a far away it looks like it's floating but it's really not it's an, it's an illusion and I've seen like loads of things um, that uses this effect I think I have um, I might have somewhere another item that that uses this effect to, to make it look like it's floating uh, but I'm not quite sure if I still got it or not but yeah I'm definitely gonna clean this up this has got smokies on it and everything because um, the box it wasn't a sealed box it had like an opening so you could like touch it so I, I don't know who touched it before before me or mum or or whoever but I'm definitely gonna give this a little bit of a wipe um, yeah it's quite good quite, quite nice quite, I quite like that I'm definitely gonna get a USB plug um, for this and plug it in my electric because I'm not gonna use it with my um with my computer all the time because um, I don't have well apart from up there but I don't really want this on all, all the time I'm using my computer like I want to turn it off sometimes so just to let's take take the plug out as you can see this is what it looks like when it's um when it's not um plugged in um so yeah it's got a really decent cable um to it as well it's like re really nice and long cable to it um so that was the review and first look at the um, Bell Harry Potter uh, USB light. Um, next time, uh, next week's review, I haven't decided yet. I've still got to look through the stuff I'm going to be reviewing. And then I will find out what I'm going to be reviewing. Um, but on Thursday I'm going to be making a tier list video like, like I said on Sunday I was going to do so until then see you guys